more confident. So it's all about technique and how you line shit. It's all technique about how you line shit up. How much? 65. This one was 80 what? 88? 88.65. You think how much you think I got? No. 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 <laughs> this nigga hit a third miss! He hit a third miss! He hit a third miss! He said it miss! This nigga hit a 30 twist! He said he gotta go straight! He hit a 30 twist! He said he gotta go straight, go ahead. It ain't done straight! No, I messed up again. Still didn't beat me. Still didn't beat me. Hold on, let me go again now. Let me, let me. Let me go straight. 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 Let me go Got it! 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 Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tomorrow night, the action begins 7 p.m. Eastern, live on ESPN and ESPN Plus. And it's time to get those fighters on the scale. From North Philadelphia. They call him the grandpa of the PFL. <laughs> he, his kid should be fighting, but he is. And he says he only goes nap time when he's ready. <laughs> They'll never let none of you young guys send him to nap time. He only's going nap time when, when he's ready. Yeah, this episode is brought to you by Barstool Sportsbook. And if you got a gambling problem, make sure you call 1-800-GAMBLER. And you got to be 21. Download Barstool Sportsbook right now. Check this out. If you use the code, promo code GILLY to unlock $1,000. Bonus. Not $100, not $200, not $300, $1,000. I don't play no games. That's my bet right there. I got Anthony Davis. Points, rebounds, and assists under 41 and a half. And I got Miami Heat money line. That's what I'm betting, and that's what I'm winning. Download Barstool Sportsbook, use the code Gilly, and get you a $1,000 bonus. Who else doing it like us? Nobody. Right! He's full of shit. He, 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 he got a uh, black belt in jail jitsu. <laughs> <laughs> See that? Yeah, that like old right man right shit, man. <laughs> It's going down. Gillian Wallow's adventures, we at right here. PFL, Shane Burgos, it's going down now. What's going to happen tomorrow? You know what I mean? I know you're excited. You're coming over to a new, you know, a new platform to do your thing. Well, why did you make the decision? The point blank, the, the money. The money, man, I'm making stupid money right now. Like this, the, you, you win this whole thing, you win a million bucks off the rip, but my, my, my contract is, it's a beautiful contract. Shout out to first round management. Man, Malky, Jose, Abe, hook, they hooked it up. Mm. So, 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 now that you're over here, you, your energy just feel good. You just feel yeah. better. I mean, the treatment of the, the fighters. What, tell us about the PFL and just the whole organization and how they deal with the fighters different than other, you know, platforms. So it's been a seamless, smooth transition going from the UFC to this. I, I didn't know. I didn't know what to expect. Almost my entire career has been, has been in the UFC. So mm -hmm. I'm going from the UFC, being used to that, being comfortable basically in that. And now going out of my comfort zone, signing with a new organization, not knowing what to expect at all when it comes to treatment or this or that. It's been so smooth. They treat me even better than the UFC treated me. I have zero complaints. I love being here. And uh, the fact that I'm at 55 now, my entire career was at 45. This, I should have did this a lot sooner, man. I feel great. How do, how do I look? Do I look like I have the energy? Yeah, you Dude, really I, feel, I feel amazing yeah. right now. It's, like, I cannot wait to show the, the world the best Shane Burgos anyone's ever seen. Like, like tomorrow night, is going like, to tap out, knock out? Like, like, what's going on? I, I don't know exactly how we're going to finish the fight. We're going to finish the fight. But the only thing I can 100% guarantee you guys is violence. If you've ever seen a Shane Burgos fight, you know what to expect. And, and this will not be any different. If anything, it will be more violent. Mm. So you're just going to get real crazy, wild. And just, you, basically, it's going to be a lot of blood. That's how I fight. That's just how I fight. That's just how I fight. Absolutely. Yeah. That is the main event. 
on ESPN. On ESPN. How do you huh? feel about that? Just, you know, come over here. Just... From the Bronx, right? Yeah, from the Bronx. Now let me ask you a question. Because a lot of my Harlem people, a lot of my uh, Brooklyn people, they hate on the Bronx. They say the Bronx is the dirtiest part of New York. Is that the truth? <laughs> I, I I don't live in the Bronx anymore. But I'm just but saying, coming up in the nah, Bronx. No, I've been in some pretty dirty spots in Brooklyn and Harlem. Oh, and okay, too, right. so, but, but don't get me wrong. I got I got to show love to Brooklyn because I train in Brooklyn once a week too. So Brooklyn, Brooklyn, cool. But Brooklyn the dirtiest part. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. He said that. <laughs> so tomorrow on ESPN, the main event. You ready? The guy's a little bigger than you. I saw him. It looked like he was a little bigger. Shit don't mean nothing. I mean, it don't mean nothing, Shit but you know, I, I looked at him and I was like, oh, he looked like he was a little, little heavy. Like, how you plan on winning? How am I planning on winning? By any means necessary, I'm getting the finish. I'm telling you right now, guys. First yeah. butt of the last belt, I'm going to be in your face trying to get that finish, and I'm, I'm going to get that finish. And you're the face of the PFL, man. I'm, I'm, you know, all in Vegas seeing you on billboards behind you. I'm like, damn, you just everywhere with this shit. All on the internet, I'm just seeing you. How does that feel, though? It feels awesome. It feels, uh, I feel vindicated, like the, all, the, all the blood, sweat, and tears I put into this sport, it, it's, it's paying off now. Like, I, man, if you guys watch my fights, like I give it my all, and just to have that paying off financially, and then like the way they're pro promoting me and pushing me, showing me that love, like, I, I, I'm gonna get show it back tomorrow night. Watch. Yeah, because they put the house on you. They, yeah. they, they believe in you, and it's yeah. good to be coming out, especially when you put so much work in, and it's just be coming into a system and an organization that really believe in you, and it's not, not we showing you right now. We not gonna wait to show you. Yeah. We gonna show you right now. We gonna put you in the forefront. You are gonna be top billing. And this is a great thing, man. I wish you nothing but massive success over I'm here. In. Keep doing your thing. I Keep will. being an animal. Right. Well. Uh, you know. Right. We get bigger and bigger from now. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Oh, and before we get out of here, I just wanna say, whenever you need an extra check. I will gladly pay you to beat the shit out of him. No, I want to do that. I'm, 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 <laughs> I, 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 no I negotiating. No, no. I'm going to cheat you like the PFL. No, I'm going to sock it to your pocket I'm like a rocket. As soon as you I'll tell move me up, up. what it takes to beat check the leather you. off his ass. Extra check. I'm just saying. Uh, what? You so said extra check. Extra check. I, right now. Listen, you I got a little couple of dollars. I'll pay you right now to beat the shit out of him. Oh, shit. Now, if you wanted to tap me out, how would you try to go about tapping me out? Uh, no, damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your nerves, no, man. I can't tell you my. I can't tell you my. That, was, that, that was my defense. You know what I mean? I just got to be on point because we different weight classes. So I got to. I can't. Uh, you know. Being safe. Being safe. I'm being safe being with him. So I got to be yeah. because of my my my, certi my certifications. <laughs> I can't really you know what? attack him like that. So I got to let him do what he wants to do. Certifications or what? My uh, fighting certifications. What you mean? <laughs> Man, jail he jitsu? He heard, he heard about me. I heard. You he no. said the jail jitsu, so he I got to respect that. He did 20 years in jail, so he got his own <laughs> yeah. karate. It's called jail jitsu. Gee, man, I want you to make it to the fight. It's, it's called do whatever you got to do to keep him up off your ass. <laughs> and sometimes you just got to run. You got to know when to fold him, know when to hold him, know when to walk away, know when to run. That's Come good on, advice. man. That's, that's good advice. Right that yeah, yeah. Come on, man. He ain't cool. Damn. Cool, Kenny Rogers. I'm just saying, you got to know. But, look, like, man, we wish you the best. I appreciate yes. that. Do your thing. I Make will. this shit count because yes. what you're doing is. And I'm betting the house on you. Rev, you but, wherever you know it or not, you're a trailblazer. Yes. You're showing people a different way. Yes. You're giving people hope because a lot of people. A lot of people are not brave enough to take that step until they see somebody else. Nobody want to be first. Yeah. Nobody want to be yeah. the first one to make a decision yeah. that's going to change a bunch of people's lives. There's going to be people that's going to be coming up that's going to be like, yo, how do contract courses look? What do I suppose to get? How do? And your story is going to be in the books of somebody to say, you know what? Let me step over here and try something new. Yep. Because there's more opportunities, and you're showing it right now, man. You, you nailed on the head. I've been saying that since I st since I uh, I signed with PFL. I, I feel like I'm a little bit of a trailblazer, but you just you said it perfectly. Yeah, because because. You got so many people that don't know. Yeah. Um, like you said, one thing you said, you shout out to your team, your management team or whatever, because a lot of people, they got weak management. They got people that don't know. Uh, they taking crumbs. They just want to be yeah. somewhere just because they say, this is where you got to be and it's the only place to be. Yep. But now with the PFL, they come and they bring a new, new energy, new opportunities and- uh, Big money. You show, you show, <laughs> believe it or not, I know, I know you got a lot of phone calls as you made the transition. <laughs> like, damn, what, what, why? What's going on? What? And, I, and a lot of they people- They gave you follow. what? <laughs> a lot of people won't follow, man. You got three more fights left over here. Can you set something up for me? <laughs> yeah, I mean, but listen, man, we wish I you the best. I appreciate you guys. Keep doing your thing, man. Will do, will do. Ah, appreciate night, the love, guys. Shane Burkles. <clears throat> that shit look good when there ain't nobody coming back at you.
He did all that dumb ass shit in jail. Nigga punched him one time in the back of his head, knocked him into a fucking coma. He woke up with his ass bleeding. <laughs> he, he woke up in the nigga cell tied up like this. What y'all do? <laughs> Let me know. What you do? <laughs> nigga legs were shaking like <laughs> Fuck out of here. He ain't talk about them. <laughs> what the fuck is that? What kind of, who stretch like this? <laughs> what, kind of, what kind of fucking stretching is that? Oh. Get the fuck out of here, man. You full of shit. Wait, wait, wait. I love it. Let's, let's do this. Let's do this. Yeah, I started to clap. I started that. Anybody know my man right here? How y'all feeling? One of the biggest internet sensations in the world. Introduce yourself, brother. How y'all doing? We got a, a podcast called Million Hours Worth of Game. Where Check we get out. a youth game, got us attention, motivation, and education. But we interview everybody from Floyd Mayweather, Mike Tyson, Young Thug, Pooh Shiesty, Chris Brown, Kevin Hart. So we interview everybody. We here to show the PFL some love on our platform. So appreciate y'all guys. All right, guys. All right, so Hotel. Let me check on the buses, but just, just stay, uh, stay put for a second. Yes, sir. Any questions? Yeah. Look at him. He's a fucking loser. Look at him. What is he thinking about? Look. I'll just sit here on Pornhub all day. I'm a fucking loser. I don't get no ass. My dick never gets glazed. I'll sit on Pornhub. Look at him. Oh, she got a fat ass. Oh. Shit, her ass is just as fat as my cellies. Sit all by myself and I don't do shit all day. My name is Wilo. I was in jail for 7,300 days. With a grown man laying right beside me, right in my bunk. My name is Wilo. You guys are awesome. Thank Where's Wallow? There's Wallow right there. Right there. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. He over there on Pornhub. Brother. Oh, man, you could have waited. Come on, let me weigh in. Fuck you want to weigh in for. I want to fight somebody. Fuck you want to weigh in for. Y'all really be sleeping on my fight game. I know. Weighing in at 217 pounds. We got to get you up there. I'm going to come in the league. 41 pounds overweight. <laughs> I'm going to come in the league and tear the game. I'm going to get the belt. Fuck is you talking about? I want to fight this guy, man. He's a bum. <laughs> Fake boxing. Philly's too fast. Right. All he want to do. Oh, no, you know, he, used, he did twenty years. He used to wrestling out. with niggas. Come help me. <laughs> <laughs> Get off me. Listen, I want to spar with you when we got the time. Oh, okay. My yeah. God. You, what would you think was gonna happen? Yeah, I don't know. Do you do? Uh, yeah, I do. Spar? I do. Uh, a little he do bit. jail jitsu. He was in jail for twenty years. So he don't do jiu-jitsu, he do jail jitsu. Oh my god, and what's the your favorite technique in jail jitsu? Well, well, you know, <laughs> pinching asses. You know. No, no. Oh my god. <laughs> no, it, no, it, no, it's it's a little different style. A biting, kicking, all type of oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? So it's like, you know, it's just a, it's new, it's coming to a lot of people don't do it yet. They don't yeah. know about it, but I'm gonna bring it to the PFL. <laughs> yeah. You think I can train you? You think I get a chance to train you? Well, I don't think I'm gonna go in the Jail, no, you ain't gotta go to jail. I'm just saying it's a new style that I'm bringing out here. Oh, okay. You know I mean? Can I do your technique, uh, the pinching thing? And the... Do that. Now, if you do that, because what's going to happen when you do that, you get a guy, you pinch him. Oh, he's going to be like this. And then he does. I don't know if my coach going to be happy. No, he Are you going to be happy? <laughs> yeah. See, he's going to be cool because what you're going to do is, it's a mental game. You throw the fighter off. See, it's about, it's about the mind. See, fighting, fighting is a, see, I've been doing this since I was little. I've been knowing how to fight. You yeah, know what I mean? I've been yeah. doing all types of stuff. But his I record had, is like 3 and 43. I had a, <laughs> he oh, takes the, he my takes God. I thought it was like good uh, no, martial no, arts. No, no, no. It's terrible. terrible. I'm good. I'm good. No. I'm good. I had a, I He's had a good teacher. at taking a punch. <laughs> my teacher name was Karate oh Earl. He was a black belt. He knew Bruce Lee. He was, he was everything. It's just that when I was coming up and I was learning, a lot of my fights I didn't win mm -hmm. because I was practicing still. I didn't really turn it on yet. Then nah, when I turn yeah. it on, I but when you go crazy, you go crazy. Yeah, I go crazy. Yeah. But I'm trying to. There's some techniques. The three times time that happened. <laughs> yeah, three times. It was, it was three times. I three times you went crazy. Yeah. yeah, and I won. Listen, that was my last three fights. Yeah. So it was like I'm. I, I, they, they want me to come here, so I'm trying to figure out what, what weight class I'm gonna be and get up in there. You know, get up in there and fight. But uh, but the fight tomorrow. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wow. 
You look strong at the way, and I, I noticed. I see you come out. I look first. strong. You look I strong. I think you're the first person you said that to me. No, you do. I look you like strong. a kid. Look at no, this face. But I, I admired the mustache. You ever seen Joe <laughs> Dirt? <laughs> yeah. The movie. Yeah. yeah. I, I, as soon as I seen the stash, stash, I was like, ah, uh, he looked like somebody I might put some money on. Yeah. He yeah. got the stash. That means he's a hardworking man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you for telling me I have a stash because a lot of people say that's not a stash yet. But no. Like, no. Yeah. That's a hell of a stash. I feel Don't it's you let them lie to you. That's a hell of a stash. What you got to do is you got to get the handlebars on the stash because that's going to intimidate them the joints that come down here yeah that's the hand i wish it was possible for me <laughs> you got a grooming <laughs> joint yeah you get the handlebars and then you go from there you know what i mean but, but how how do you feel being in the pfl oh uh, well the minion millionaire so i feel great <laughs> oh, 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 damn Heck, they, so she, you love it huh yeah i yeah, yeah. love this shit yeah i mean it's great you no know? uh and then they, they put me against shane and what else can I ask for, you know? Absolutely. You want an Absolutely. interview with you guys, maybe? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, exactly. That's one thing. You you, but you got that done. So tomorrow night, main event, ESPN. How does it feel? Pretty good. First uh, main event. First time I see my face in the, on the poster. Mm. So when yeah. you got to Vegas, you saw your face on the poster. I mean, come on, man. Yeah. Did you FaceTime somebody back home? Look, look at me. No. I'm not the, this kind of guy yet, but... Uh, <laughs> you say yet? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe tomorrow I will. Maybe, maybe tomorrow. If yeah. we get the win, huh? Yeah, of course. Right. Absolutely, man. So so when they made you a million, did your lifestyle change? Did you go out and buy a bunch of yeah, shit? Yeah, you know what I, what I bought? What? I bought one thing, okay? Well, I bought two things. I, I bought some Pokemon card. You know, my fucking parents like told me not, not to buy a Pokemon card when I was a kid. And mm -hmm. if I bought this Charizard, I would have been like super rich right now. So I bought <laughs> one Charizard and I bought a bidet. You know what's a bidet? What's that? It's like when you go in the bathroom, you know, it... it, it, it they spray it? Yeah. Okay. It's, and it it's, clean. it's like the Ferrari of bidet, you know? It's, you know? It cleans your ass. It, it cleans everything. It's hot. You know, it's because in Quebec How much it's, it cost? it's I would like to lie about that, but it's like 400 bucks, so it's not that bad. But uh, yeah, bro, man, like it's super hot when you sit on it. And I have to admit, I don't piss standing up anymore. Mm. You know what I mean? Does it clean you up? He never pees standing up, though. But listen, right? Think about that. He became a millionaire and bought an ass cleaner. Yeah. He's a hell of a guy. Yeah, bro. Like, oh, what, what do you need? Car. What else do you need? Like cars? <laughs> yeah. I look well, at did. those losers with cars. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> look at that. Look at that loser with cars. He's a loser. He has three Benzes for no reason. He said, look at the losers with cars. <laughs> now, now uh, tomorrow, what's going to happen? A fight. I'm going to fight. Like, uh, that's, a, that's a big question. I want to know what's going to happen. That's why I'm doing that. I don't do that predictions? for uh, money. You got any predictions? Oh, yeah, I'm going to win. What, 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 what round? First round, uh, first minute. Mm. Damn. Yeah, That's yeah, a hell of a prediction. Yeah, so confident. That's I'm going to go crazy the first minute. Like, all in. You know? Oh, you're leaving it right there. You're leaving it yeah, right yeah, there. Yeah, bro. She said, fuck that. Oh, man, there. listen. Yeah. Tomorrow night on ESPN, main event. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry <coughs> for make sure, insulting No, no. Your, make, sure uh, you do the, make sure you do the pinch. <laughs> <laughs> you got to pinch They're going to be like, ah! So and then you go in. <laughs> See, you didn't even see that. No, see, I see, thought you were going to <laughs> grab me. <laughs> see, you didn't even like, see yeah, that. I was kind of that's scared. That's different. Nobody never done that instead. You never seen nobody do that. I was like, oh, that's I'm real. Surprised. Surprised. He worried about that ass pinching technique you shit you talk about. Right, you talk about shit all wide open for a kick, whatever. Look at you. Appreciate you though, man. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, man. Good luck. Everybody's coming over. My man just said they made me a millionaire. <laughs> He's on the other side getting knocked out for pennies. <laughs> Come on over to the field. <laughs> Get you. Jake Paul came over. Jake came over. <laughs> Come on. I might debut my fight. Knock right up. At 118. Kick him right in his neck. He's going to run right into the cage. <laughs> Boof. Kick him right in his joint. All that boxing shit, that shit going out the window. No, it start with stand up. That's that shit how don't it mean start. that they gonna kick you right in your neck. We, we can work out a check, me and you can do this. Yeah, I ain't wanna no, like no, no catch weight or nothing. I wouldn't even wanna hurt you. No catch weight or nothing. See, see that footwork, you don't know nothing about that. That's what I do. Shit I do right there. That's what I do. <laughs> Let's see it. 
Let's nah, see right I'm not going to show you. Let's see it right now. Your fighting crit criteria is beneath me, man. Bro, you was fighting for your life in a prison yard. No. This is not the same. It's not. It chased you around like a <laughs> <with a> knife. <laughs> this is not the same. I'm not going to lie. This is not a lot of leather. This is not a lot of leather. Great. Full of advantage of this man. Uh, there you have it. I mean, do your thing, no man. I wish you could look. You can get it. Amen. Tap out. Tap out. Don't worry about it. I'll break the camera out of pain for it. Dang, this motherfucker is heavy. Look at him. Look at him. The three time state prison PFL wrestling he champion. Like, he looking at me like this dude knows something. No, he does. He said this guy he knows something. He's like he's full of shit. He'll go to sleep in the first minute of the fight. <laughs> he like this guy knows something. Get a good picture of me. <laughs> he's a loser. PFL. Him do a stink. They do a stink. Got a few. Good luck. What do you say? Yeah, bro. That motherfucker stinks. Shape-ass nigga. <laughs> this nigga still look like he Bro, can, you he can be hooping too. Wait, I was watching him all day. Yeah. 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 Come, nah, he, <laughs> Damian Gillard, Chauncey <laughs> Gillard, <laughs> Sam Gazelle, <laughs> Gilbert Arenas. Yeah, I'm everybody but Kendall Gill. Kevin Hart treatment. Fucking with them eagles down there. Oh, man. Them motherfuckers <laughs> killed me, man. <laughs> it was a defense, man. Them bitches ain't make one play, man. That shit was Fuck crazy. We, let the, we done broke records. All these niggas got all these sacks. We don't get nowhere near that nigga, man. That was the crazy thing is, though, in, in fairness to them, how they ain't water, no fairness, man. Them niggas ain't the, get hey, nowhere near them niggas, man. Everybody played on the field, but I think Philly was a little faster, and they, the field was drenched and wet down, and they, they kind of... Hey, bro. Mr. TV, he ain't going to say that. Hey, bro. But I know what I look That boy that played quarterback. That boy that he, played he quarterback. Gangster. The Kansas City different, bro. Yeah, he is. He no, way. but he, they should have got some pressure, man. We had four niggas with ten or more sacks, man. Them niggas didn't get near that nigga. But you're man. But you gotta think of this they too, scared. though. We start folks. Remember how they? By remember how they lost against Tampa Bay? All their linemen went down. So that's the first thing they did after that. They said, "We know 15 could play. If we keep them clean, we win." Yes. Had Orlando oh, oh. right tackle was good. But goddamn, yeah. we could have got some pressure. Times, a lot of times, even if I if I tweet it or if I say it, it's because I'm going through something, or I'm praying about something, and I'm dealing with something, and I'm just sharing that thought out loud. What does it take for you, though, man? Like every morning, man. You know what it is, man. Do that. Like you got to think about this shit. You know, in the county, we probably got like 50 homies that die. I'm here every motherfucking day, so it's like I came up, I won. Most of my friends in the penitentiary, they dead, they on dope. So you gotta understand, that shit is different. It's a different type of, it's a different type of thing when you wake up. My brother got killed, he died in my grandma's arm in the house we grew up in. So I gotta look at, I'm still here. Out of all them dudes, I'm still here. So 
why can't I wake up and share some shit with people? Because I'm happy when I wake the fuck up. Right. I'm not, you know, even if I, you know, when I was in jail, I was happy. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So when I come on on the streets, I'm happy. It's like, man, you just be like, it, it, it's something that's some, it's something that's just different, you know, on the aspect of like. I think people complain so much and they don't understand how many motherfuckers died today. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, you sit back, like I pay attention to a lot of shit, I'm gonna show you something. We sit back and we look at all this other shit. Look at this shit. This shit right here keep me humble and just keep me, you know, cause we ain't promised. Come here, look at this. This is world media, this is real time, world population. That's the world population, birth this year, birth today, death this year. Look how many people died today in the world. It's gone, real time. That's one day. Today, that's today, bro. That's Look how many people color. died this year. 18 million in the world. So when I wake up, I'm like, damn, I made it. Oh, it's game time. <laughs> I got another. Yeah. Like we be thinking everything gonna be like, everybody think it's gonna be like, job. I've been to more funerals than I've probably been to birthday parties. But the other the other piece of it though is the, the, the selfishness that you feel because you've made it and the want to to say, okay, I need to take care of me. When you do see all that death, I'm just speaking of, okay, I feel this and I'm willing to share it. I want to share it. I want them to hear it. And I was just saying, like, some days, I'm, hell, I'm, I'm motivated, but I'm working on me. And to be. It ain't able, nothing wrong with that you know shit because you know what happened is, uh, I can't speak for the other communities, but in the black community, a lot of times when we come up, say you take a, all right, and this is what y'all need to talk about. You take a white athlete and you take a black athlete, just being real. When he gets to the, this quarterback from Oklahoma, he go to the league. His dad and mom already got the house, the farm, the truck. They don't need nothing. Yep. When we go to the league, we behind the eight ball because our mom probably was on crack, our dad was in the penitentiary. We still live down the way. We got, okay, I'm going. Oh, yep. you already good. Oh, you go you got to help all these people, right? Yep. You got to help all these motherfucking people. So now you got your, your money and then, you, then you're going to fall out with a lot of people because they said you went number three so in the draft pick. Right you see yeah, what I'm saying? Nobody. Listen, you went number three in the draft and you got all this money, it's, it's, it's public. So now, your cousins, hey, you gonna fall out with them? Your aunt needs some money? The crazy thing is though, we would have life skills meetings where everybody- They don't have these talk, if you and, and, and when you would talk about it though, like the, the white guys, I still got my truck from college. My parents yeah, bought me a truck. I'm gonna leave you over this. Yeah. This what the motherfuckers is not teaching them. Because you know what happened? As soon as y'all come to the league, they got some old white man with a baggy suit coming in and talking about motivational speaking. That shit ain't got nothing to do with these niggas going through real life shit. That's real. Yeah. And the NFL, the NBA, all of them is disconnected from the reality of these niggas need to know about these bitches that's going to be in these cities that's trying to have their baby. Get with me, man. Hit me up, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Honor y'all, bro. Real talk, man. Honor to meet you, bro. You funny as shit, baby. Yo, you funny. We're going to get up, man, for sure. I'm getting in five hundred million with you, young I'm going to sleep. <laughs> That's right, young. You know, that's your boy, shit. Okay. I'm going to go to sleep. Young boy strong as shit. The fuck out of here. Young boy strong as shit. Ain't going to do shit. You know he going to stop some shit. <laughs> you know he don't eat. Nigga, I don't get haircuts, nigga, till fight day, nigga. He stopping something. I can tell. He going through this job. He need to cut. Nigga, he got to cut. Yeah, he got to cut. That's, he got the curly cool. shit too. Yeah, he wasn't. Pretty boy. Pretty boy over there. Philly? Yeah, they oh, him? Yeah. No, he ain't from Philly. Oh, I thought you said Philly boy over there. But I'm from fucking Philly. Like, what's wrong with Philly, nigga? They ain't bought him, man. <laughs> you know uh, y'all bootleg Philly, man. Oh, hell. Oh, 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 Nah, I fuck with ball. But honestly, the Baltimore and Philly niggas is the they they the close them. I hate when niggas be like, y'all like New York, nigga. No, no we fuck, not. we yeah, not. Yeah. Fuck you talking about? Don't talk about the New York boy. No, we not. Niggas, no, no, we didn't. That's what we did get from New York was the sweat. Yo, 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 upstate. Yo, he from upstate. Wait, that nigga from Syracuse? <laughs> nigga, you from Canada, nigga. <laughs> nigga, you from where Drake is at, nigga. You from Toronto, nigga. Upstate New York. <laughs> How old are you, young? 19. 19. That's third grade. He's fourth grade. He you pro young? Yeah, he in the fourth. He's the fourth grade. He's the fourth grade. He go up to me. What you fight, 160? Nah. 154. 154? Yeah. Yo, how you do? Well, you ready, huh? Yeah. Stop him. Lock him in, man. He crazy, man. 
Hey, you know you South Paul or you Orthodox? Orthodox. This is a sparring day today? Oh, nah, we, we done sparring. Oh, we done sparring? We like a week out. Oh, yo, <laughs> y'all want to spar to a week out? Yeah, Two nah, weeks out? Make sure that weight right. Yeah. Where you at right now? You look like you're about 165 right now, man. Nah, I ain't, I ain't that small. I'm like 68, 69. Yeah. I told my boy I had two curves and, and an apple. And an apple. <laughs> and a bottle of water. And a bottle of water. What, you, what weight you fight at? Oh, 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 shit! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two thousand yeah. where he fights at? Yo, oh, 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 shit! Yeah, he quiet in the motherfucker. Oh, he quiet. Look back. Yeah, t shot Man, nigga, fight at one twenty, man. No, one eighteen, man. Hey, he weigh the same amount as my daughter, man. They say he hit like a, a one sixty though. That nigga gonna hit like no 160. You a fucking weight bully. You not, that's why you ain't supposed to be fighting no 118. Y'all cheating. Oh, wait, bitch. You see how he changed the subject? He's a bitch. He's a bitch, man. He's a bitch, man. Strap up, big guy. Come on. That's our play. That's our play. He's going to strap the fuck up. You see him get up. I said strap up. That's how I play. You don't want to do that. Strap up, man. You don't want to do change that. your life, man. Come on. Nah, get up in there, man. Turn his electric off. I turn your shit off. <laughs> See, I ain't playing. Turn his electric off. He lucky I got some shit to do today. You must ain't playing your electric bill today. I got some shit. I got some shit I got to do. Hey, Jamil. That's why I ain't. You know what I mean? That's what I'm saying, man. But I stepped to the young boy. You ain't say nothing. Yo, what, what is his record to be? Just, just off the, off the fuck you mean. First of all, first of all, I'd, I'd, I'd got, I'd got. Stop, 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 stop. Nigga, first of all, I'd have been fuck 15 to know from the gate. Cause I'd have got 15 motherfucking cab drivers out of New York. I'd have iced them niggas to get my record up. So I'd have been 15 to know from the gate. Fuck you talking about. Then what would have happened after that? It was nothing weird to never know. You see what the young boy said? Once I had the serious test, and now it's time for him to step it up. That's when you see, nigga. You see what young boy told him, coach. Hey, Kyle, you see what young I mean, your weight class. Young boy said, I mean, and he set the fuck down. All that shit he was doing. Let me just tell you something. I hit young boy with a body shot, sent him to the white ribs, man. Put barbecue sauce on this shit, man. He got a fight next week, man. Fuck out of here. I sit down on this shit, look. I sit, I sit down on this shit, man. That good, nigga. Let's do two rounds, me and you then. Fuck, we gotta do two rounds for. Do two rounds with the young boy. Nigga. No. What the fuck is you telling me? You gotta do two rounds with the young boy. Hold up, it's not gonna bite me, right? You wanna try two? No, I never wanna try. One, two. I don't fuck with snakes. Oh, there you go. You want three snakes? There you go. Two. How many snakes? I got three. You want three? Come on, give me, give me. Stop fucking playing, man. Yo, yo, get him, man. Come on, come on. Stop come playing, on. man. Hold on, hold on, hold on, man. Come on, man. Don't only bite on Saturday, man. It's Friday. Come get it. Come get it. Stop fucking playing, cuz. Wait, wait, wait. We got Stop one more. fucking playing. One more. We got three now. Yo, what the fuck is you doing, man? All right, you can take it off now. It's a wrap. Wait, wait. Get... Oh, let's do it on your neck, cuz. I'm done. Ah, I'm good. Let's do it on your neck, cuz. Come get him. Come get him. Ah, good. Come get him. Wait, you got to go in with this. Oh, shit. He's down there. You got your back, cuz. Thank you, man. Dumbass out of here. Thank you, guys. Thanks, man. Snake man now. Welcome back to Professional Fighters League action. Lightweights and welterweights have taken center stage here at the theater at Virgin Hotels. I got Clay Coward and I got the Canadian fucking gangster on a two team parlay. A thousand dollars, gonna get me back 2800. Watch this year. <laughs> See, it's all about technique and how you line shit. Yeah. It's all technique about how you line shit up. How much? How much? This one was 80 what? 88? 88.65. You think I got it? No. 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 That nigga is the 
a miss. He hit a dirty three. He hit a dirty three. She said it missed. This nigga hit a dirty three. He hit a dirty three. She said it gotta go straight. Go ahead. It ain't going straight. No, I messed up again. Still didn't beat me. Still didn't beat me. Hold on, let me go again now. Let me go straight. 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 I messed up. It's technique, nigga! It's technique! It hit the side! It hit the side! Oh, I got it! It hit the side! Got it! Got it! Let's go, Clay! I got three grand on you! <laughs> Another over here left, Clay. He going to sleep. Talk. Over here left, Clay. Oh. He at your kahunas. You take a kick to the kahunas, baby. Go up in your stomach, huh? Kick him in his kahunas, <laughs> jump he's one up in his stomach. <laughs> Over here left, it's night night. He ready to go to sleep, Clay. End of the punches, Clay. Use your distance. Jump on his ass, Clay. Oh, oh, he got him again. He ready to take his legs from me. This motherfucker's an animal. Oh! Oh! Yeah, oh, he's taking his legs, what I tell you? He's taking his fucking legs from him. He's beating them legs up. Oh! Oh! No, oh, he's taking his legs up. You good, Clay? You turn this shit around. This your fuck, come on. You turn this shit around. He tearing them legs up. Oh my god, man. Oh! We fucking him up. We fucking him up. Finish it off, good! Play one. Cassie, play go. Knock all the way out. I ain't got nothing to no, do. No, we with UFC. It. I get to kick and all this shit. I'm, I'm bringing my style in. I'm, I'm, I'm bringing my style in. Yo, you must don't know how he fight. Let me show you how he fight. I'm going for his legs. Never don't fight. Let me show you how he fight. I ain't worried about none of that. I ain't worried about none of that. Lightweight champion, the Canadian gangster. Three grand on the line, baby. Come on, Canadian gangster. <laughs> yeah, you fucking come on, buddy. Here you go. He said he's coming out. That's right. He said he's gonna knock him out in the first minute. That's what he said. Tell you, Shane. That's what he said. He said he's gonna knock him out in the first minute. Let's see. Let's see. I would never go against somebody with a mustache like that. <laughs> He looks like he still smell like yesterday. He's not playing no games. He's relaxed. Look how relaxed he is, cuz. Look how relaxed he is. Look how relaxed he is. Get 
keep rolling, Shane. Yeah, she ain't running into something. Go ahead. Hype him up. So he's running into something. Oh, Lord, knock his mouthpiece out. Lord, yeah. He got it back up. Show him violence, Shane. Don't, this, you don't want to show certain people violence. All right. Get violent. His name is the Canadian Gangster. Shit don't mean that. Oh, Lord, 2020 split. Canadian gangster th throw, a, throw a jab and an uppercut is right there. Throw a jab and an uppercut. Jab and an uppercut. Jab and an uppercut. Oh, he tried it. Lord, he tried it. Jab and an uppercut. There you go. Keep him at distance. Jab and an uppercut. Jab and an uppercut! Oh, oh, beef ribs. Beef ribs! No. Oh, yes. Jab. Oh. Go one to the body now. End it all with some. End it with some. End it with some. Yeah. Olivier. You won me 4,000! <laughs> I wish I had my phone on there. He said, no, thank you. <laughs> no, thank me. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't do shit. All three judges scored about 30, 27 for your winner. The Canadian gangster, Olivier Oban Mercy. You want to get that money? Shout out to the Canadian. Yes, he did. I, bought, I bet on Canadian gangster. Yeah, yeah, he won. And, co <laughs> and, and collar on a parlay. Yeah, Canadian gangster, my boy too. Good job. Congratulations. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yeah. We interviewed both of them yesterday. I cannot go against the guy with a mustache like that. <laughs> Looking like he don't take showers. I had to. The other dude was too groomed, too well. He had a new haircut. He was. This dude looked like he didn't even wash yet today. He just woke up and came to fight. I stink and everything, it don't matter. I'm a fighter. I smell like dirty gym socks. Here's the important 33 cents. Yes. Here's the 28, 33. Thank you. Uh. Uh. <laughs> when you win, nigga. <laughs> when you walk in, nigga, and you win real fast. When you walk in, nigga, and you win real fast. Betting on the PFLE. <laughs> Kick ass. <laughs> My diamonds, they wear like water Got what you need, place your order More green than a forest Push up the rock like a Ford Hop up in the foreign, I floor Nigga get fly like a tourist She steady hit me up, I ignore her Ain't about the money, I ignore her Put that shit on What up, Uncle Gilly? Put that shit on, baby What's up, baby? Put that shit on What up, what up? What up, baby? Good to see you, dawg on up like this. You did. Like, oh, listen, oh, get the football out, man. I'm tired of this shit, man. You, know you, ain't getting, you, ain't listen, you ain't getting around me, man. Come on, one, two, three. You, you ain't getting around me. You ain't getting around me. You're not getting around me. You're not getting around this shit. She just, you ain't getting around this. Tipping on all that. I mean, I'm like, man. <laughs> no, that's not that going on. <laughs> See that? I got hops, man. Come on, you Put did. Put that shit on. Put that shit on. Yeah, yeah. Put that shit on. Put that shit on. Put that shit on. <laughs> where, you, where, you, where, you, where, you, where you at in the history of the NFL? Where you at? 
What number you at? I'm talking about your position. Yeah. I'm the best to do it. Mm -mm -mm. You know what I mean? And I call my own shot. Most of you guys, they die out, they walk out, they limp out. Okay. You know what I'm saying? You gotta yeah. leave the game with a good feeling. You know, every guy wanna win the Super Bowl and then they leave out after they're on top. You know, you know everything. Every good thing's come to an end. Yeah. Especially in sports, you gotta be next for the next transition. Right. Sometimes you get caught in the moment. You don't know how to transition. You don't know how to transition. That'd be the rappers too. Let me get yeah. in there. Yeah. You get caught up and you can't even. Yeah, you don't you even stuck. know how to do it. You walk out stuck. You know, y'all gotta pop that for the. Walk out stuck and broke. So you gotta go and put that oh, in. Oh, you know how to do that? <laughs> <laughs> Stop bitching. Stop bitching. He jumped back at you. 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 He Eagles, they went out. That look good on you. You can take that little that you can crown take out too, off. yeah. How you do that, Ben? Go ahead and do it. I come already, kind of smell you. There you go. Historic. That's the stadium. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's the stadium yeah, show. Yeah, that's, that's, the stadium. Care of that. yeah. that's the stadium inside of that joint. And he got his name on the side with the with the number. And they do them joints. And you can look underneath, inside the ring. So what the model was, it's the mod ties, you know, honor, respect. Trust, loyalty, and respect on the inside of the ring. You see that? Hold it. Bam. That shit on. That shit on. But uh, we appreciate you for coming through, man. Keep on being great. Keep, Keep doing, doing it, baby. you. And uh, look, look forward to the season. Albany Empire. They coming. They're going to win the chip. That's the prediction. They're going to win the chip. You got to talk. Speak shit into existence. They're going to speak into yeah. existence, baby. They're going to win the chip, baby. And somebody going and, to. And my man going to have. And my man, he going to have eight. Malik, you going to the league. After this season, they coming to get you, baby. He going, he going, he going to the league, baby. <laughs> he going eight sacks, two forced fumbles, and a fumble recovery, and a to touchdown. Yeah, one game. I called it out. One game. One game. Damn, Damn. you think That's he was pop? Game. <laughs> That's a damn one game. He good after one. Wait, hold on. You think he was right? You think he was pop? He said one game. His pop, the only nigga had nine touchdowns in one game. <laughs> like when you got nine touchdowns in one game, your pop was a bully. Big he told that nigga, you don't throw the fucking ball to nobody but me. <laughs> you gotta have it. It is fast. Yeah, you gotta get it. That's all they was throwing. Either that or your pop was always open. Both. All the above. Who had better footwork, you or your pop? Me. You gonna say me? Oh, I just gotta ask you. We don't give a Pops paid on the carpet out here. I was in grass with studs, seven studs sometimes. But you gotta understand. Who gotta use more footwork? Okay, but you gotta understand this. Your, your pop set the presence for you to be able to look and watch. Yeah, he set the standard. He set the standard. And he shot you out his kahunas. So he my double mama, great. My mama dropped me out. Huh? No, he shot you out your kahuna, his kahunas, and he then your the mama club. dropped you out. He was like, Sean, he shot so the club. He was double great. He got a gun. <laughs> <laughs> they shoot, they shoot. Major, Major look. <laughs> Hey, Mama so, ain't duck. So shout out to hit. Shout out to Big E B, wow. right? E B. Touchdown Eddie Brown. Touchdown Eddie Brown. Eddie Brown. E B. Shout out to Pop. Hold on, that about that 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 dude that dude got a hell of a ring to it. Eddie Touchdown Brown. Eddie Brown. Touchdown Eddie. <laughs> that sound like OG. Touchdown <laughs> Eddie Brown. <laughs> For his ninth one. Damn. Damn. <laughs> you never heard that. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> shout out to Big Eddie, man. Uh, it's all love, man. Albany Empire. We'll be here for a couple games. Going down. It's just like that. Right. Been in booming. That was Been booming, booming. Baby. Nigga, that's a so no, good. I, I, <laughs> you got to get this on video. Of course. You, you got to get this shit. You got to get this shit on video. Let me see. Oh, yeah, he was done. I stopped. <laughs> I stopped. Ready? Here we go, ready? One more time. Here we go. Ready? Let me see you again. Come on. Hold 42. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Boom. Set up. Oh, oh, oh. I, oh, oh, I, oh, I stopped oh, AB. I stopped AB. I stopped AB. I throw that shit real. I throw that shit real. Come on, one time. Come on, one more time. Hold up, he grabbed my arms. I ain't know they could grab your arms. I got to back down. Hold up. Ready? Set. Hey. Woo, baby.
bad oh, throw. That was a terrible throw. Stop, they beat it. No, you did not. Let me see the ball. 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 Come on. Let me see the ball. He got these fucking moves. We got a real football in there. Shit. Let me see the ball. Uh huh. I'm bringing that motherfucker up. <laughs> no, it's not like me, man. I should have been there. You see this shit? I should have been in the league, baby. <laughs> hey, you gotta bring it to me. Put that shit on. So, 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 so AP, let me just say this, right? Okay. So, okay. so, so, okay. So, I'm in my stance, right? Yeah, yeah. If you in your stance, right? So if I'm a cornerback, we're just giving some game to the youth, the wide receivers all across the country, right? Yeah. If I'm, I'm in. So say if I'm playing you to the inside, right? But you want to get back inside. How you gonna run that route? How you gonna set me up? So I'm gonna give you the first one inside. Mm -hmm. Cause you gonna go for the second one. Okay. So I'm gonna give you a one two. Oh, oh. Short <laughs> oh, okay. okay. long. Okay. Short okay. long. Okay. So all you wide receivers, you gotta see how you gotta get to the inside. Because he guarding you inside, but I gotta get there. Kind of I have to get there. First. So I'm gonna give him the jab. Just wait, like up, uh, up, uh, oh, right back, huh? Two, boom, boom. Okay. Short, long See, look, I'm giving y'all some game on the wide receivers across the world. You get that footwork, nigga. That's the yes. double up right there. 140 catches. Mm -hmm. And you never changed that shit? No, I never changed it. Damn, how they don't, how yeah. they don't catch on to that shit? Because then when they catch on, you just do one, and I'm gone. Mm. Now I wait for that other one, and I already ran. Yeah, I ain't, but I ain't know they could grab your arm. You grab my Jones, dude. You grab all of them. I said, what? Damn. That fucked the whole game. Nah, you said too low. I thought, I thought that was a violation. You should grab my Jones. That was a violation. You're like, damn, motherfucker. <laughs> Throw you down. <laughs> thought it was a flag or some shit. You know? Yeah, you know you, they run motherfuckers out of bounds, all kinds of shit, man. That's crazy, man. I, I remember one motherfucker. I remember I was watching the Colts. Yeah. Play to go to the Super Bowl or something. That motherfucker from New England was running Marv the fuck out of bounds. Yeah, you gotta put the ball out of there. Yeah, you gotta run. Oh my god. Oh, the long time. I'm like, yeah, cornerback from, uh, I'm like, damn. I'm like, this little nigga strong as <laughs> shit. <laughs> like, they, they, uh, Indianapolis lost that shit too, man. I was rooting for them motherfuckers. How many touchdowns you got your career? I probably got like 83 catches, five returns, one throw, and like six in the playoff. Damn. Yeah. Look at that. He said five returns. Yeah, he fast as shit. Though. That's crazy. Can take it to the out? That's a I think it was Tyreek Hill before Tyreek Hill. <laughs> <laughs> his, train, his training game was crazy. Yeah, you got it to Casey. That train, that train, man. How old is he now? 34. 34? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Man. He know he can still do it. He like, I ain't doing that shit. That's crazy. I no, got my money. I'm Hall of Fame. I'm, I'm out of there. Live a little bit, you know? Got my ring. Got everything. Yeah, you, you, you. It's called God. Mm -hmm. That's it, you know what I mean? Anything you could do in football, you yeah. did it. Yeah, check. Grateful, you know, I just got my health. That's the more important thing. Yeah. That's major. Because yeah. uh, a lot of motherfuckers. I used to see my motherfucking business partner after the season, boy. That nigga played, he played defensive end. So he like, he like, get I go, I get 55 car crashes a game. Mm. Me, me and another nigga's helmet is hitting probably about 60% of the game. Bam! Nationwide. Bam! Nationwide is <laughs> on your side. You know what I'm saying? He did, so, he did a short, so your body. So after the season, <laughs> he'd be literally walking up the steps like, ah. Uh, a nigga be like three weeks Ice before. Bears. You know what I mean? But you know, when you go to the game, you might walk in the building like that. By the time you hit the field, they, uh, yeah, right you now. good. You like, damn. I'm <laughs> you walk in, ah, shit, my head, ah. Oh, I'm good, nigga. <laughs> I'm ready, nigga. Dude, what the fuck happened to my hip? Ain't, ain't nothing <laughs> wrong with it. Ain't crazy. That ain't shit went off, nigga, like, ah, ah, ah. Hey, no cap. That's what got like fucking head That's my hip in my ass in my back. That shit, he love that shit. For real. That two o'clock gonna get you right. Boy, that shit get you right, right, though. Ah, make you a little more aggressive. Take the edge. You know what else you want to do, right? Leave that man to take the shot. Hell yeah, the more you get, the more you gonna have to take it. So all the way back. Take. That ice bath shit don't mean nothing. Champ, you, you, you fight like you fight so every game, you gonna swell up. The older you get, the stuff you eat, now the swell out might not recover as fast. 
So this little yeah, shot is just like a stronger Tylenol that's going right to your blood. So like let's say if you still sore or something, aching, this is going to take it off. But look, like you ain't going to really... Mm. It's like a bit stronger Tylenol that's going straight. You ain't going to feel shit, huh? Yeah, to after. But how long it lasts? It's all in your head. It's just going to take the edge off. This shit, like you say, your hip was hurting. It just ain't going to make it hurt where you really... You gonna be good for them hours right there. That nigga had to take one before the game and then came in at halftime like, ah, I need another one. Oh, damn. He was fucked Double up. Double down, man. Motherfuckers be fucked up. This is how it was. How it was to walk around locker room like this. <laughs> patting this shit. Yeah, he patting this shit. Damn. <laughs> Imagine you a young bull. You like sitting an old nigga walking around with his socks on. Like, hey, man, what the fuck you You just got your, you like, fuck, take time. You know what I mean? You try to make it. Oh, yeah. You're trying to yeah, you're fighting to keep it going. You gotta keep it. You need that money. Oh, yeah. His wife. Oh, yeah. been in his locker room. Yeah, it's pressure. Oh, yeah. been in his locker room four thousand times. He don't even give a fuck about how young boy think. He walk around. He probably naked and shit, slapping his head. Fuck off. <laughs> 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 he don't give a fuck. He's 38. He on his way out. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> he like, man. He like, young boy, you gonna be here soon, nigga. You last long enough. Yeah, Trust right. me. You can get past eight years, nigga. You're gonna need that. Get right. <laughs> oh, anything. My fucking pinky toe, man. My shit fucked up. <laughs> yeah, right now. <laughs> Fix the flat, yeah. yeah. Nigga, like, oh, my shit good. <laughs> my pinky toe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, damn, that shit is crazy, crazy yeah. But, so AB, he let me see one of his watches, man. Look at that shit, man. Look at the diamonds all in the back of that, man. I would tell you niggas how much it costs, or I had to kill you niggas, man. <laughs> You know what I mean? I can't even tell you niggas what it called. Look at that, man. Mm, mm, mm. God damn. Y'all niggas take them little ass rollies home, man. This little ass rollie home. Look at that shit, man. Come on, man. Oh, my fucking God. Yeah. Booming. The business is fucking booming. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. Put that shit on. <laughs> Put that shit Put on. Put that shit on. Listen, man, hundred million dollars worth of game. At least, at least, at least, at least, shit. Be working. Hold, hold on, watch this one. Wallow in the bed, I get it, a kid. Get Put it that a shit on. Uh, look at the bracelets too. Ooh, he got the he got the handcuffs on. That was crazy. <laughs> Nigga took his jersey off, man. <laughs> Take my own shirt off in our own yeah, building now, you feel me? Yeah, that part. Nigga still in shape, nigga, goddamn. Yeah, I got this shit on. <coughs> you still in hella shape, too. This shit in me, you heard? Yeah, it's in me. You work out? I'm still giving up three to four rounds. Oh, Man, shit. where the eaters at? <laughs> 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 Still give me three, four minutes. <laughs> <laughs> you see?